Lauren, it's highly unusual to see a gas utility invest so much in mobile, right? Yeah, they do do a lot in mobile, and it's interesting because they've been able, they've expanded a lot in mobile. They started small with just an iPhone app and have since expanded to an Android app, a BlackBerry, and a text alert program. So I think they're definitely seeing a need for consumers, which makes sense, I guess, because there a lot of the utility payments are last minute things. People think of them at the last minute, right before they're due. Nobody pays for a utility bill, and they're when they first get it, you wait until it's you know almost due. Um, so it makes sense that you would want to do it real quickly uh, on your handset. Now, was there anything that stood out when you covered this story? I think what was interesting to me is just how much they've expanded. I think a lot of companies, when they tap into mobile, they only use one platform, and that's it. It's kind of a, a one hit and miss kind of deal. Um, and I think what's interesting about this case is that they've they've expanded. They're rounding out their mobile um, offerings into a full package of things. And um, how would it work with text? You get text alerts when your service, when you, when the energy um, goes up, like if your energy bill is going to go up in the next month, you'll get a reminder like, hey, this is what's going on, just so you know. Um, you can get that either through text, email, or um, other different digital initiatives. Great. See you later today here.